This is Asus ROG Zephyrus 2023 Duo 16 model and I managed to crash it. Come on. What the hell? Asus, come on, you gotta be better. This is considered to be one of the best laptops made in 2023. It's got the most powerful Ryzen laptop, mobile laptop till date. Uh, it's got the most advanced NVIDIA graphic processor. And so the apps that I have kept open is DaVinci Resolve, Lightroom, Google Chrome, File Explorer, and Catalyst Browse. And right when I was working on this Catalyst Browse to show that it was actually fast, it hung up on me. The screen went dark. Uh, actually, I was using three screens, right? One screen, the monitor, and two of these screens from the laptop. And it crashed on me. This is the first day I purchased the laptop. I installed very minimal softwares only for my photo and video editing. And I was expecting it to be used for a long time and it crashed on me. This is unbelievable. Anyway, I'm going to edit this video right after restarting this computer in the same laptop. So let's see how this goes. This is unbelievable. Asus, come on. See guys, buying the most expensive and most advanced product, most fast, fastest product in this industry doesn't get you get your it doesn't get your work done things like this happen and this is the second time happening on the second best laptop in the market right after scar 18 from asus again i had to return scar 18 to get this laptop and this again is bailing out on me guys how hard can this be yeah apple doesn't work properly asus doesn't work properly and I don't know, I don't know, uh, this is what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to unplug. Ah, yeah, so I unplugged the monitor. And so this is exactly uh, what I'm having right now. I, ha I have unplugged the monitor. I'm going to force restart my computer right now. This is unbelievable. No matter what kind of laptop you get, it's going to be performing really bad when it comes to heavy load. ASUS, come on, you can do better. I trust you, right? So this is how it looks when I start my computer. Windows Hello works really good. Uh, the Republic of Gamers screen comes up really fast. Keyboards light, light up as I have said in the armored crate. I set to the teal color, which is brilliant in these laptops. Now we can see that Windows Hello is going to be working very fast, very fast indeed, and it's blinking on me. Everything is supposed to be working as it is, like it's supposed to work good. How can it, how can it stuck on me again? Oh, come on. Uh, this is the first day I got, my, got this laptop. I replaced Scar 18 for this laptop. Asus was kind enough to allow me to exchange for this because that wasn't working even after motherboard change right within one month mark and yeah this is unbelievable asus how bad can your products be i'm going to send an updated video right after editing this video all right don't buy this guys you know i i want to say don't buy this guys but this is a very unique model, very uh, fast processor. I'm really impressed by the speed with which I was able to export 375 photos from Lightroom. I was able to uh, edit uh, using DaVinci Resolve, but running them side by side together, it's such a load, I guess. Uh, I will connect with my monitor, edit this video, and I will update. I will keep updating on the progress of editing uh, from this laptop setup. Uh, one more thing I noticed was this monitor was very cool, but this is supposed to be more color accurate. And this screen is actually very warm. 